We're here in Piccadilly Circus for the switching on of the Ramadan installation lights. Let's see how we got on. Ten. It's so inspiring to be able to see this. The fruits, the fruits of our labor, this was so long in the making um, and I couldn't be happier to see this up here. Like, I'm really hoping that people get inspired to start doing this elsewhere in, elsewhere in Europe, elsewhere in the world as well. I mean, I know some people elsewhere in the world have their own variations of Ramadan lights, but I think having it on a street iconic like this in other cities will help Muslims feel like they're a part of that city, which is just so important. Um, this is Ramadan lights. I started it three years ago in my hometown in North London, where I put Happy Ramadan structure up, fundraised fully by the community. It's very much a community-led uh, initiative. Um, wanted to just do it on a bigger scale and uh, had dreams and ambitions of doing it in Regent Street and Oxford Street and Coventry Street and Piccadilly and all around London and hopefully taking it nationally and then going global. It's uh, just incredible. The response has been amazing. The support has been amazing. Uh, it's surreal. I think to have the Ramadan life in a place like Westminster in the heart of London is just uh, it's a victory for us all. For, for anyone who sort of supports diversity, supports inclusion, is Muslim like myself, is an ally, is, it, it's just I don't know, the best way to put it is it's really it's, it's a great achievement and we're really happy to have it in Westminster because there's no other place to, to have it to be honest with you. It's the first one in the UK, first one in Europe, hopefully not the last and hopefully year on year it gets bigger and we're able to expand it to other cities all over all over Europe but I think to have it in Westminster is a huge statement. This is the, the heart of government, the heart of our country. You know we get excited for even the Christmas lights but having some form of representation for us is like I can't believe there. The fact that all of London are going to see it, I don't think people realise how much it's going to mean to Muslims, even if it's for 30 days, it like, it means a lot to us, it shows diversity in where we live, um, in a place that we might feel a bit secluded sometimes. Well obviously this is a monumental event for all of us here, whether you're non-Muslim or not, we've never seen something like this in central London, so having like our religion represented on the streets in the heart of London is absolutely phenomenal. <laughs> I mean I feel like I'm floating right now, there's so many people and it's been such an overwhelming response but such a beautiful response. I mean, everyone's come here to support family, friends, influences, the mayor. I mean, everyone's coming together and it's just such a beautiful moment and such a great way to start Ramadan.